वेलकम टू द सेकेंड मॉड्यूल ऑफ वीक वन द मेजर फोकस ऑफ दिस मॉड्यूल इज इंफॉर्मेशन सिस्टम्स एंड सिक्योरिटी प्रिंसिपल्स वॉट आर इंफॉर्मेशन सिस्टम्स बिफोर दैट वी मस्ट नो वॉट इज इंफॉर्मेशन इंफॉर्मेशन इज अ मेजर रिसोर्स ऑफ एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन टूडे नो ऑर्गेनाइजेशन कैन सर्वाइव इन द डिजिटल एरा विदाउट प्रॉपर इंफॉर्मेशन सिस्टम इन प्लेस all automated semi automated systems they all span around information and information systems that contain details regarding the software hardware data people and procedures organizations today are highly influenced by information systems to do their business in a modernized way to start with we'll try to define information system an information system is a well organized system for gathering establishing storing and interacting with the information organizations use information system to do data collection filtration processing creation and distribution in complementary networks in other words information systems sees both core data and peripheral data of the organization and its environment information system stores the database objects over a wide range of time period the transformation of data into knowledge is the main role of information system with respect to technological evolution information systems have become the backbone of the organization to support decision making and provide value to the organization the most important challenge the organizations face today in this digital era is security the information system security depends on the process and the methodologies applied for keeping the information confidential available and assuring integrity here security is provided through access controls protection methods and detection with remediation by documenting the events information system security deals with all forms of data protection as already mentioned information systems they are the integral part of any organizational activities and processes therefore information systems function properly relying on the individuals the companies as well as sometimes even government a devastating situation may arise when proper information system is not in place so there are certain factors that have been identified that threaten the security of information systems they are lack of awareness wide open internet access and finally the network traffic we all know information is important asset of an organization and failing to realize the data value leads to a loss of data and security breach in information systems mostly policies procedures and controls are used to enforce the protection of information system and data policies and procedures they help in implementing the standards in the organization whereas the internal controls they provide the basis for the protection of information system and data the internal control methods provide plan for safeguarding the assets reliable and accurate information improving the operational efficiency and finally adhering to policies
naturally there are some important issues in information systems because it faces a lot of problems either in the form of cyber crime or through computer abuse due to the increasing evolution of ICT but both are executed differently cyber crime denotes a use of computers by individuals to perform unauthorized or illegitimate activities causing damages to the information and the other resources that reside inside an illegitimate user can easily access the information during the failure of a hardware and software fire electrical problem personal actions user errors and even telecommunication errors therefore information systems move into more threatened state during the exposure of the telecommunication networks the major threats to information system today are spamming hacking jamming malicious software sniffing and spoofing identity theft and cloning all the above mentioned threats are explained in detail in later section in summary the important point to be noted here is that security is a major challenge in information systems the security principles in other words we can also call the mas is basically put in terms of a triad we call it as cia confidentiality integrity and availability apart from the three fundamental security principles information system security requirements also focus on system configurations because based on the well defined security guidelines and the authorization of users the system or the network configuration are changed accordingly in addition to this triad there are principles for maintaining and securing information systems they are accountability management of data trust isolation change and compliance these principles are applied over the entire system development process and security is enforced in the system 